intro take three. Yes, three times I've been trying to get this intro done. The first time it didn't work out. The second time I noticed that the recording wasn't turned on and the third time for some reason my guy got stuck in walking mode rather than running mode so I was trying to figure it out for 10 minutes how to get it back to running mode. So that's a good start of today's Monday. For today we are going to go out and explore in a different biome because our mission will be a catfish because we're going to need that for a casting mold for the smithing table so we can progress further into this game all right so i had a few couple of comments first of all i had a comment of lulu saying the ship should be called bf partial boat 12 and i always google names before i add it to my series and parcel boat 12 is or either a traditional dutch boat which um, moves packages for children uh, it is a whole traditional story behind it i uh, don't want to go too deep on it and it also showed like dhl package boats so you know it is fine by me so for the people who wonder how you write that it's like this bf parcel boat 12 now thank you a lot for the name suggestion, in the future there will be a lot more name suggestions needed because we are going to build like a village type city deal and I'm going to need to have a lot more shopping names, I'm going to need to have vehicle names, probably a couple of other ship names. The reason why we're here because Michael Albertine actually told me I need to change this, the place of the bat because when you die the game sometimes might spawn you on a wrong side. And this bed was actually upstairs against the wall, so the game might have, you know, spawned me inside of the wall, uh, which is not going to be handy, so that's why I placed it back down here, and now I can just walk all the way around it. So thank you for the warning, I really appreciate that. He also gave me a few couple of other handy things, so first of all, he told me to use containers. Of course containers will, you know, give me more space in my inventory. I will talk about what you see right now in a second. So like I said, I tried to record before I forgot to hit the record button. So in this case, we have a herb bag for all the plants. I'm going to, need to grab more plants and stuff. We got a gold pouch and I wonder, does it only count for coins? Maybe pebbles? Can it also be gold statues? I just have to see how that one works. I also have a coal basket. Coal is probably something you find in different biomes. I haven't found it so far on this biome. So yeah, that's why I'm also having this with me. And then this toolbox. This is what he actually suggested to me. So in this toolbox are tools. So that's very good. And as you can see, you know, it's like um, nine, ten things. And of course I made one, two, three, four things. So I got like six blocks of space uh, back for it. So thank you a lot for that. And he also told me that I'm going to need to use my seashell drill on uh, the postal spots or rocks to get more marble out of it. So I need to build one of these because for some reason I lost all my tools in the front of this uh, thing, which in the episode I didn't see a shovel on the bottom. <laughs> this is very silly. Uh, Any house. So I wanted to get rid of these, um, you know, these uh, containers up front. So I thought, you know, let's build a tiny little side dock area type of deal, which is by far not finished. And just place these containers down here because, you know, sometimes I can use like extra containers. And then I was like, okay, in one of the containers there are these step stone, so why not just spread them out like this? And then I was like, the pitch looks very bald, so let's just place some rocks and palm trees around on the beach let's terraform this terrain a little bit so it looks like a lesser you know like it had like a, a straight steep uh, type of deal around here so that's why it looks chunky i like it a lot better and then i was like oh you know these plants look nice on the beach let's place them around because they are placed in sand so I cut it a few couple of these plants to get the seeds and then I want to place the seeds around and the game was saying nope you cannot do that and I was like hey bro these plants are in the sand so why can I not replant them 
So for some reason this is just how it is. I actually told the developers, you know, it is silly that these plants randomly grow onto the beach, but when you cut them, you cannot use the seeds to, you know, plant them wherever you want. So I hope they're gonna do something with that. If not, it is fine. It's all going to be fine. Anything else? I oh yeah, I'm going to need to make the uh, the seed drill, and I'm also wondering if I. No? Okay. Uh, if I make this drill, I know I can mine on all kinds of other stuff. Do I still need the pickaxe? Oh, it's called a hand hand drill. Okay, let me just fix this thing and then we are uh, going to head out. I got some bread on my ship. I got some repair stuff on my ship, so... Yep. Alright, off we go. Now, I have been watching a few couple of Corellus, his old videos for the people that might know him. And he made some island videos way back in 2017. Oh god, that is very noisy. I noticed at his little boat that he had like a small little flag on top. And the small little flag uh, actually showed the wind direction. And if you go with the wind, you go of course faster. Now I'm not quite sure if there's still a thing in this game. Uh, but it might be handy to actually also have that on the ship. Right, how about that tiny little flag over there? Of course I have another one for this side, so it just looks, you know, equal for the people who have a bit of OCD issues. I'll place this one here, hold the button, sink it in. Okay, so the wind is coming from that way. That is actually very good to know. Look at how fast we're going right now. Oh boy, that's so neat. Now I understand why sometimes you go very quick, sometimes not. Now I knew about this, of course, in 2019, but, you know, I completely forgot about it. Now the wind goes that direction. Alright, we can now travel to another part of the map. Now, can I actually just do this and then that and... Oh boy, look at all of that. 45, 40, 40, it's quite something. Okay, then I guess let's just go here. Uh, stinky Dark World. Oh god. Oh, ah, my game crashed. Dreamy Dragon Zone. That sounds a lot more nicer than Stinky Dark Zone or whatever it was. And I've seen snow. And meanwhile, I'm actually loading this stuff up. I'm actually wondering, did I bring my fish net? Because it would be very silly to go out on adventure to find catfish and don't have my net with me. I, I, I don't... I don't... Nope. Okay, so I don't think making a net should be that difficult, or at least I hope it shouldn't be that difficult. Oh god. Now the thing here is, I say this because, you know, like, look how big it is, and then again, we are actually not here to explore islands. We are here to catch some catfish, right? Oh boy, this is a uh, big girl. I'm not sure if it's bigger than normally, but... What? Two islands together, or is it... Oh, okay. Now I can imagine it's cold out here. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah. The hell? Oh, I thought it was like a freaking whale. Hey, there is a little cottage out there. All right, all right, all right. Just stop this thing, Jesus. All right, let me see this. Okay, there is supposed to be one at the front, and this. <sighs> Bully rhinos. Oh my god. I'll bet they're aggressive though. But how aggressive are they? You know? Stuff like that. Ah, ships. Bully rhino. Oh my. Okay, no, 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 you don't have to, you don't have to, okay, that is, what the hell is that, is that a badger, a massive one, is that, a wolverine, oh god, 
got these were a lot of fun in Far Cry always. No, 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 you don't have to. Man, this, this place, I don't like it. <laughs> Instant just level one, two, tier one, excuse me. No, no, no. Damn it. Okay, it might sound a little bit pushy, but I do not like this biome. The point there is, I, you know, rhinos are my favorite animals, and I absolutely don't like killing them. It's a little bit a holy thing for me. The point is, I don't, I don't want to murder these guys. It is cold out here. I don't like it. <laughs> Catfish. I see some fish down there. And now the thing here is I'm going to need to get a new fish net, right? Kelp is in the, on the bottom, I think. A pole. But the only thing I'm going to need is kelp. Is that enough? Hmm. Puts it up in the herb bag. Okay, very good. Let's fix one of these. Mm-hmm. Let's uh, put it into the toolbox, and then from the toolbox, let's put it in here. Alright. I don't see anything here. I'm freezing. Uh, it's only at a certain point though. I thought I seen fish, but yep. Salmon. Okay. Um, it's this game doesn't like cold, or at least with what I'm wearing right now, I'm slowly losing my health. Hail butt and salmon. You know what? I would actually like to try and see. First of all, yeah, okay, so that is what I'm guessing, like, certain fishing stuff will protect against cold, and I know for sure a better fishing thing will give better protection to cold. So what I would like to do, since it's causing less trouble regarding to what I'm wearing here, is temperate. You know, just a little down regions type of deal. <laughs> Now here's the thing though, if, you know, for some reason it really is here in Tundra, uh, you would say I have a problem. Mm, not really, I have an idea what I could do if this really causes that much trouble. I wanna head out here, I guess. Sheep sound. No, oh, that sounds nice. So what I could do is just... Um, I need to have this uh, vendor which sells an iron air tank so I can get longer underneath the water. Now what I can do against the cold is try to wear warm clothing. So the t-shirt and the pants will be warm clothing. Anything else I have to, you know, do swim gear type of deal. Alright, I'm hungry for a couple of islands and okay, that's very nice. Now I can imagine this region needs to be nice, right? I know it's not a, a tropical, but I know it's also not snowy. Now let me see where I'm at on the top. You know, I would say this map looks smaller than the, la the last one. Alright, question for you guys. In which biome would you rather have your home base and ultimate city built and why? There is something that I'm wondering right now at this moment. Ooh, statue. Okay, let's park this thing right out here. And just check it out for a second what's going on all the way. About here. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, we have one thing down here. This island doesn't seem to be too big, but I might need to check out the mountain there. And of course, it's not about the island. It's about... What is around in the water, right? 
Wow, look at you, Cyclops stone. Yeah, there are a lot of berries. Mm -hmm. If I just do this, it makes a lot more sense. Glowing mushrooms, tall oak seeds, coniferous, bird seeds. Okay, see, I don't think I have that. I'm not sure if these are seeds though, but you know, I can always come back. I mean, that's gonna be the first time that ever I will be here. Okay, there seems to be another thing right out there. So far, I don't see trouble. You know, that is at least better than, you know. Oh, okay. Well, there you have it. Yo, trouble. Also see a lot of iron here. <laughs> In your face. What on earth is that? Whoa. Whoa, what is that? What level is this island? One. No, it okay, you got this and you got that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Alright, now I got 17 coins, which is very nice, or uh, gold at least. You know, to be real honest, that looks... That looks like something that's gonna give me out. And also here, it's cold. Ay ay ay, I'm going to need to figure something out for that. Ah, oh, you also got a little buddy there. Hmm, you know what, you can keep it. Ah, uh, you know, having a little bro is always nice. Oh, and a lot of these quartz crystal. I'm going to, need to get rid of this stuff here first because, yep. You know, there must be something real bad going on with that. Do I want to do this, you know? They don't really seem to move or do anything, but... But what? Uh, will that not change when I... You know, try to uh, open a chest? Damn it. Okay, weapon, I mean... Oh, that's not too bad. <laughs> and man, I, 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 I really thought this is the end. And now I can open it. Holy smokes, okay. Jesus, I, 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 I you know? Hmm. That uh, looks very interesting too. It's like just small, you know? It's not ginormous, ridiculous. Oh, fish. Get your butt over here. I guess this is two now, whatever. Salmon. Alright, let's check it out. Please, no sharks as yet. Ooh, what is that? Is... The hell? Did it just move? It's freaking moving. What is this freaky stuff? Okay, I, I, I'm I blown away right now. And the reason why it doesn't look like I'm blown away because I actually need to go to the toilet. <laughs> Alright, here I am again. That is uh, very satisfying. Uh, going to the toilet. Yeah, anyhow, yeah, that eye over there. That is so freaky to have that. I wonder what it is. I wonder what it means. That looks indeed very, very nice. Now, of course, I can go closer to it, but I don't think it will reveal too much for me. I really would like to check out that little island there. And I hope that it's tiny as I think it will be.
Mm. That's a little bit too tiny of an island, though. <laughs> Okay. Oh, what? This just... The hell just spawned into my face here. Also seemed to be another shipwreck over there. What the hell is going on down here? Okay, wait. There's something there? Oh, there is something there. Let me just get into the water. Oh, catfish? Nah. More salmon. The heck this mountain. Okay, I, I'm going to need to get a little bit closer. I would like to check it out. It's... It's... It's so weird how it just spawns in the face like that. Okay, okay. There is so much around here. One by one. That looks like a mini tiny island there. Which I like a lot. That's an airplane, which is kind of deep. Uh, but let's keep this in mind, all right? Let's keep that in mind. I'm, I'm really going to need to have, like I said already for 400 times, that iron air tank. Oh, look at... Ah, oh, an island and an island. Okay, yep. Level 2. I've also been thinking, if you need a lot of hay, just build a campfire in there. <laughs> gold of this and gold of that. Oh, what in the crap? You know, to be real honest, I think it's actually cool to see something just very different, you know? Okay, did I say cult over now? Yeah, I'm not completely sure if I like this now. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so that piece of island is right down the corner of the map. Left down the corner so far, I don't see anything, also not when I went around it, so... Now, I see this island just popping in and out, I'm a little bit skeptical, but... This tiny island... Hmm, makes me think, right? Makes me think. Yeah, I know. I will. I think it's just because I'm only wearing one thing. Does this mean this is true too? I guess it is. Hello? Is it me you guys are looking for? Health Hunters. Oh god, no. Ooh, okay, not too bad. What are you guys? Salmon again? Get your butt over here. Okay, and I saw some tiny fish over there. M Makrel Schor. Yes, that's Deutsche fish. <laughs> no. Okay, this actually has a cold resistance of 14. Right. Now, this doesn't say... Swimming stuff. Okay, swimming, 5. Swimming, minus 10. Ay, ay, ay. But could I handle a little bit of more cold if I at least wear one thing? Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to get all the way back to the tundra and I'm just going to, you know, keep one type of clothing on and see if I'm a little bit more resistant against the cold in the water though. Must be right. Alright, here we go. So I'm going to do something here and that is... The point here is... So far I could lock 
it didn't look like something interesting, right? That that is okay, I guess. So in this case, we're just gonna generate a new one here. The democratic teenager land. <laughs> All right, let's just confirm that one, and you know who knows. Right away, we're gonna get like the island we want in the face, right? Tiny, no weird stuff around it. I'm just gonna take it. Eh, that doesn't look very tiny. Jesus Christ, look at that island in the back there. Oh. That island in the back is absolutely insane. So the only thing that I can do actually is just move my ship for a bit, check the water, get out, move my ship for a bit. I repeat that over and over and over again and on that way I might be able to find something it's gonna take quite some time though um yeah if if it's not going to be any different than that then then that should be the way it is Monday this episode and Wednesday there will be another episode of exploration so if you know if you can confirm right that the catfish can be uh fish it somewhere then let me know down below in the comment section and thank you all for your comments earlier on the videos i hope you had a very nice weekend by the way and then i'm just gonna try and see if i can get some catfish meanwhile and then i'll uh, catch you guys wednesday again